Storm doors save energy by letting in light without letting out warm or cool air. Installing the storm door is a great DIY project that can be done quickly with two people. Here's what you'll need. The first step in installing your storm door is to get accurate measurements before you purchase one. Measure the height of your door frame from the threshold to the top of the door. Take measurements from the left, right, and middle and choose the shortest measurement. Measure the width in three places as well. Six inches from the bottom, six inches from the top, and the center. Use the narrowest width. After you've purchased the right storm door, the next step is to install the hinge side door frame called the Z-Bar. To get accurate measurements for the height of the Z-Bar, temporarily attach the rain cap at the top of the door. Then measure the height of the door opening from the underside of the rain cap to the top of the threshold. Mark the measurement on your hinge side Z-Bar, and if needed, cut the bar to length with a hacksaw. Attach the Z-Bar to the side of the door where it will hinge open. Place the door in the opening. Press the Z-Bar against the door frame and secure with the included screws. Now you can make adjustments to the rain cap. Make sure to leave a quarter inch gap between the rain cap and the door and add remaining screws. Check to make sure the door opens and closes easily and make adjustments if necessary. To attach the handle side Z-Bar, use the same method as the hinge side. First, measure from the bottom of the rain cap to the top of the threshold on the handle side of the door. Mark the measurement on the handle side Z-Bar, and if needed, cut to length with a hacksaw. Position your handle side Z-Bar in the opening. Leave a quarter inch gap between the rain cap and Z-Bar, then secure with screws. Install your handle set and door lock hardware according to the manufacturer's instructions. To install the sweep, trim any extra length and screw it to the bottom of the door. Open and close the door to make sure the weather stripping evenly covers the sill. Install the door closer and adjust the speed of the door by loosening or tightening it. Now your storm door is secure and ready for any type of weather. Good luck and thanks for shopping at the Home Depot.